Welcome to 12 to Your Health. I'm Dr. Derek De Silva. Are you an organ donor? Seeing how that decision impacts another life can make the choice a lot easier. Here with us again this week is Elise Glennon. She's the Vice President of the Sharing Network. We're also joined by E. Denise Peoples, a woman who got a new lease on life thanks to an organ donation. Uh, Elise, let's tell us once again a little bit about the Sharing Network. Uh, the Sharing Network is a nonprofit organization responsible for saving lives through organ and tissue donation for the 5,000 people on the waiting list in New Jersey. And, uh, there are really 5,000 people on this waiting list just in New Jersey? Just in New Jersey and nationally 120,000 people are waiting for a life-saving transplant. That is unbelievable. Uh, Denise, uh, Denise, tell us a little bit about your story. You received what? Double lung transplant. Wow. Yeah. And when was this? This was in 2006, so I'm celebrating 10 years. Wow, and, and uh, we, have a, we have some full screens coming up here that you can talk to us about because I believe this was a race or a five, an event that you yes, participated in? the New Jersey Sharing Network has an amazing event the first Sunday in June, and it is a 5K walk run. And uh, I have a team, the EDP Breathing Easy team. And uh, we, it's a day that is amazing, 10,000 people, it's, it's, it's great. That's amazing. Uh, Elise, tell me a little bit about some of the common myths associated with organ donation. Uh, there are myths for a variety of reasons that, that people come up with. I think the majority of it has to do with a lack of education and fear about organ donation. So we really encourage everyone to learn more. Visit our website at njsharingnetwork.org and get the facts about organ donation. Denise, what would you say to people that are out there that are considering, I, I don't think that's even an issue to be an organ donor. What, why, why is that even an issue? Fear and the lack of knowledge. That's, that's what it is. Yeah, but you need, don't need your lungs if, you're, if you've passed away. You don't need your kidneys or your whatever, your heart. For, yeah, for some reason people think, oh, I won't be whole if I give up these things or if, for some reason, you know. But uh, it's the greatest gift to be able to give life to someone else. Well, you guys keep up the great work. I thank you very much for joining us here today on June 5th. Thank you. And if people want, real quickly, website information, real yes, quick. Yes, njsharingnetwork.org. Super. Thank you so much for joining us. And here, if you'd like to have any questions answered, if you'd like to email them to me at 12dhealth at news12.com, or what you can do is head over to our Facebook page, and you can post your question there. Thank you so much for joining us today. Here's a look at this week's Community Health Calendar.